as the course is designed on CATIA which is a CAT tool so let's uh, discuss some details about the CAT tools only about the CAT tools first thing comes into mind is how exactly this uh, evolution of uh, CAD CAM and CAE started so the evolution of CAD CAM and CAE started with the drafting engineers uh, developed the CAD tools for solving the purpose of drafting first then later on the updates in these technologies came and uh, the tools for uh, other applications like computer aided designing manufacturing or computer aided engineering came into picture before this evolution of CAD or computers engineers used to perform the manual drafting as uh, it is shown in the figure or images there are drafting sheets available which are too larger or bigger than the size of engineers itself it used to take many engineers as well as much time to build a single drafting or manufacturing drawing for a single part then later on the evolution of computer came computers were used to create the drafting and later on the tools were developed for designing as well for modeling as well later on they were used or developed for manufacturing as well as analysis now in the current situation the technology has developed that much that you can easily create a simple model or drafting on your mobile phones as well about the CAD tools uh, still there are some confusions related to what exactly is the strength of these CAD tools and uh, knowing the CAD tool is most important because if you don't have any idea about the strength of your tool then you have no idea about your own strength as well if you don't have any idea about any particular feature then you will not be able to use it and that is your weakness not the strength so let us understand what exactly these CAD tools with the evolution of computers can do so the CAD tools can actually convert 2d to 3d say I have some sketch available like if you must have seen the plans of uh, civil engineers so whatever the plan is that is a 2d if you want that 2d to be converted into a 3d then yes you can perform it using the CAD tools you can even convert 3d to 2d say you have a model created you want the manufacturing drawing or the drafting required to be generated yes you can perform the same using CAD tools you can create the assemblies in CAD tools as well you have multiple parts available for a machine you can develop the machine in the CAD tools by assembling those parts there is a separate environment available in each of the CAD tool for assembly easy to modify you can go for easy modification of any of your part or assembly in the CAD tools say you have created a machine using some parts and you have assembled it so you have a machine is available in your CAD tool any of the update comes in any of the part of that machine then you don't need to create that machine or per parts again what you can do is you can use the facility available in the CAD tools for further modification and you can modify it it will be automatically updated and reflect the result within seconds next facility is relation between parts we in the mechanical engineering use nuts and bolts these nuts and bolts are of specific sizes 
so while creating the models in the cat tool what we can do is we can define the relation between nuts and bolts so if i have to change the dimension of either nut or bolt definitely i will need to change the dimension of either of them either i will change the dimension for nut or i or i will change the dimension for bolt it will be automatically updated to its counterpart the same thing we can provide the relation between other standard parts as well like in case of nut itself all other dimensions of nut are dependent on the diameter of nut so those relations also we can provide using the cat tools which makes our modification as well as modeling very easy analysis of part using the cat tools we can go for the analysis of parts as well a simple example i have created some parts i have created the assembly of those parts as well now there is some clashes in the assemblies some of the parts are actually overlapping each other each other while assembling them for sure if those parts were manufactured i will not be able to do the assembly as those parts are actually overlapping each other but in the cad tools yes we can assemble it and check it whether there are clashes or not if there are clashes then initial initially only we will be able to modify those dimensions and we can resolve those clashes and we then we can send the parts for manufacturing so that there will not be any kind of problem after manufacturing during the assembly we can even calculate the parameters of any particular part or assembly say i have created a part i would like to know about the volume about the weight about the inertia or center of gravity of the part then using the cad tools using some clicks only i will be able to get it i don't need to manufacture the part and then wait it no to generate or to calculate the volume i just need some clicks and i will be able to get the volume of that particular part even we can assign the materials to the parts so that we can get the exact value of center of gravity inertia as well data storage as we are using the computers it is very easy for us to store the data earlier there were drawing sheets available which are a bit difficult to carry a bit uh, difficult to store as well but now we have all the data in the soft copy format we can put it in the pen drives hard disk we can even store it on the servers we can share that data as well if required and uh, that is very easy because uh, the files are hardly in mbs not in gbs so we can share it over the mail as well plm product life cycle management using the cat tool we can even predict the life of product and if your cat tools are connected with the plm then you can even maintain the life cycle of that particular product yes it is necessary that uh, the organization for which you are working they are uh, storing they are maintaining the data then yes you can maintain each and everything about the product's life so due to these applications due to these facilities the cat tool actually plays a major role in product development there are many more facilities available we will be discussing these facilities later on while we will cover the tools uh, during our course on katia